Ooh, what's up guys? This is the Rifleman and I am back to bring you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as Venice. And in this episode we are landing in South America. The force we're up against is tiny. Let's go wipe them out. Uh, but yeah, mostly where our campaign is progressed to, because this is one of my true world domination campaigns, uh, we are effectively going to stack forces up in Europe ready to uh, order 66 Dagestan and um, their allies in America we are pushing troops over to invade the continent and then in India we're preparing for that operation by growing our naval forces ready to blockade the entire subcontinent so we are against a small handful of native melee troops so I imagine for the most part they're going to be hidden off the bat Let's get all my artillery set up, get my infantry formed up. We're pro what's probably going to happen? Well, if I had to guess, we're going to see one unit of troops on the field. And then nothing else. Okay, I'm going to scout with my heavy cavalry. Yeah, there it is. So they're probably, they, I mean, they're most likely all together, though. Okay, let's get everyone set up. So that poor unit that's exposed is taking all of the artillery fire. Now, how to have to shoot round shot if they want to engage. Trying to lure me into something. So about Thirteen enemy troops. forward in chunks. is limbered up. Okay, let's have a look up here. Aha! Okay, let's be a bit more intelligent about how we set up our line. let ourselves be caught. There we go. Found the enemy hideout. Hideout. Get my general up here. Provoke the Native American warriors into battle. Native American warriors being mown down. Perfect. Okay. Which 
We don't really want to be in the town quite. Sierra on the left flank. Start to split our artillery fire against the enemy positions. There we go. Yeah, they've all been forced to come out and play. Get up, heavy cavalry. Draw these troops all the way through town. Yeah, they're shattered, which is great, although they're going after my cavalry again. Them. As these guys advance up, fall back to the infantry line, because it looks like they're coming to get you. Let's get to switch it and switch to quick climb. 99th regiment's up, quick climb coming in. 99th. Give them a volley. Switch my howitzers to round shots. Tank the unit in the centre. Push them out their shuttle anyway. As are they. Right. Push the pincers of the cavalry forward against that last unit, which is their general. Oh no. Go get them, heavy cavalry. Shatter them. They're only bowmen. Lost cavalrymen to friendly fire. Let's get out of the way. Just because right now we'll be charging uphill, which we don't really want to do. That's right. Come on to the flat ground. Heavy cavalry commit, get my other heavy cavalry to the top of this hill. She just get in. That's enough of a enough of a downward slope there by Avery anyway. Excellent. Oh, we just killed their general in the last second. Nice. Um, yeah, that is the, that is the capture of Cayenne done, which is good. Get some more spices onto the trade market and a gold mine as well. But we don't have any money. That's the last action we can really do because I think we've sorted out. Okay, Havana and Santo Domingo both need to be brought in. We can't get hold of Moose Factory. I'm probably going to invade York Factory as well with one of these armies, but they're out of move points, movement points. Um, okay, some of these armies need a bit of bolstering. We need to send more troops over to the Americas. But to do all that, we need money. So you, what you can do is you can like try and keep hold of Cambridge, because it's a modern university and it's just better than your other ones. But right now, uh, really, it's about speed. I just want to get Britain... Get Britain um, subjugate it as quickly as possible. So I'm going to accept the hit to the research and get that done.
So all my armies are moving up to the coastlines. I think we st I'm still do just want to really fortify the bejesus out of the Persian front. Because when that kicks off, we want to just storm through and open the northern front against the Mughal Empire. So that when we go to war with them, uh, the Mughals will have to deal with attacks on multiple fronts. <laughs> yes, don't worry, Bavaria. Your time will come. Good old pirates. Right, let's make sure we move in to repair and upgrade the territories we've just captured. Works on striking England. Uh, no, they are not. They are happy. So both of these are going to become church schools because we want to generate more Catholic priests and ship them over to America. New town emerges. Sarador. Here you go. Have a craft workshop. How is Kazan? Still becoming Catholic. What about Archangels? Becoming Catholic. They're still converting. As are you. Upgrade you. Don't upgrade these buildings yet. We want to just make sure we are upgrading all of our infrastructure as quickly as we can. So we really don't want. Don't worry about military buildings in places like Sweden because we're not. We've got plenty, more than enough military production right now. Upgrade you, upgrade you. So then we've got a steam dry dock and a naval hospital right next to each other. That's pretty good. Okay, Doro. Upgrade the vineyards, upgrade the weaver's cottage. Upgrade the iron mine. Here we go. Barini, get you aboard, get the rake aboard, get you over to America. Okay, You're, you are replenishing and you're one infantry unit short. Actually, you're recruiting lots of stuff. Uh, I could probably stand to free up some stuff here although they may well be deploying elsewhere let's move my rakes up to come on move my rakes up to the city you are moving up to the Savoyard border let's replenish Marseille it'll take a bit of time to convert Paris Minus four. They don't like us one bit. We all ready to attack Stuttgart, uh, really? So it's to Europe to full strength. Um, I'm going to move over to here because when we attack Württemberg, it will be a race effectively. Can we capture the city before they bring all these reinforcements to bear? And you probably can, but two is better than one. Uh, Mr. Carducci. You need got your cavalry, you've got a skirmishers, you just need some infantry, so let's get two mercenaries plus three three infantry. Not colonial line, we don't want any colonial line. Ooh, riflemen. Okay, line line. You guys are at full strength. You're ready to attack Munich. This army is at full strength. They'll be able to push towards Italy in Naples itself. We probably. Okay, first of all, I suppose it's Tunis that we need to get these troops from. We can get riflemen here. We can use riflemen here to bolster this. Army, but it's mostly going to be line infantry, colonial line infantry. We can have them sat there ready to attack Savoy, probably generate another army and deploy up here. 
um, to defend Naples. Although I suppose we could just slowly generate a garrison here at Naples. If they can attack, if they attack Naples, that's really quite useful. So let's just generate. Yeah, let's get some more line infantry in here and just defend Naples. Because once we attack and capture Rome, that's it. Game over. Fleet arrives. So our first fleet that's over here to try and intercept these Mughal, these are Maratha fleets. Loiter and block off the Strait of Hormuz. Local knowledge gained. Excellent. A bunch of recruitment results. Okay, let's check my ministers out because there has been an election. They're all generally pretty good, except for you. Plus one navy, but my navy guy is really quite good. Boop. Yes. So this is our new guy, Cecilio Colombo, amusing cat. Nice. Okay, let's get you out here and deployed. Uh, okay, right. The Americas. So, Havana, we don't really need that government building. I would rather have a... I'd rather have a, uh, relig a, a civil administration building in here. Take a bit of time to fully get, but... Okay, let's get more sloops, because for the time being I can move this sloop out to Nigane. Let's upgrade that to a trade port. Upgrade the sugar warehouse. Recruit a colonial militia are still among the cheapest. Buccaneers are actually ever so slightly cheaper, but they are a limited unit. You'll build a militia, go garrison San Juan. Let's turn this into a church school, try and get more priests around here. Actually, I might even take that conscript and say we don't want you anymore. You've been very useful for a long time, but we're going to get a buccaneer. And down here, same thing. French Guyana don't want the government building. Okay. Advance onto Paramaribo. Repair the port. Good. Okay, up here... Take Diligenza. Probably move take you. Well, I suppose I should really check. <laughs> check that I could actually attack Huron and not get screwed over. Ah, uh, Huron. Just allies with the Iroquois and the Mu. The Mughals really like us, though. I'm going to risk it for a biscuit. Risk it for a biscuit because they're my... Oh, they're not my... Oh, oh. I don't think they'll join them. They really like us. We are so strong. And we don't have a border with the Mughals. That's a big thing. Whew. They broke their alliance with the Huron. Nice. Okay, getting to Fort Albany. You guys push in and attack Moose Factory. I mean, we are going to fight it because otherwise we're not going to get much fighting done <laughs> at all. Um, and I don't want, to, don't want to just keep auto-resolving these smaller pirate territories. This army, the army we're using right now has got a lot of artillery. What I think we do. Rather than being coy like last time, we just want to march up into their faces. Uh, no, we're really good for artillery off the bat. So here we'll do, we'll trot up to this raised ground. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, to everybody except you. Group all my elites and skirmishers on one flank. They're going to push up. 
Crescia and Light Horse can sit together. Heavy Cavalry on the left. to expose themselves at some point. Storm the cavalry forward. So my cavalry on the right is going to go after the general's bodyguard. They don't like the rocket artillery. Come on, you cad. You were a Britisher once. <laughs> I guess the arm tries it shattered. Let's see if we can expose. Oh god, there they are. Kill them. Kill them all. Get out of the way. Get out of the way of the light infantry before they start killing you. Oh, great hits. Swiss Mountain Jaegers have opened up. The Guerrilla Mercenaries are going to make a start. Yeah, they don't like that one bit. Shrapnel shot. We could just storm in, just annihilate them. <laughs> yeah, there they go. Before the shrapnel shots even hit. The artillery sees fire. Heavy cavalry go for General's bodyguard. Light ca light cavalry go for the routing troops. them. I'm just going to run through mowing them all down. Just shatter them. Shattered, shattered, shattered. shattered. Enemy general's been killed. There we go. <laughs> the poor garrison of this army. We don't need to don't need to chase them into the woods like animals. The territory is ours. Repair the government building. Repair my what it, I didn't lose anybody. I'm sick. Repair the fort. Demolish the pleasure gardens. We're gonna replace it with a church school. Everything's fully upgraded. Awesome. Can you guys leave? Okay, even after the even after the destruction of the uh, pleasure gardens, they should be okay with us. Advance towards Fort Salt to Marie. Make sure we did deal with you. Okay, back over in Europe. Okay, Gavino Mendoza. Heavy first. Okay, let's add some third rates onto that. Okay, up in Brest. Your navy is growing. Here at Portsmouth, you're building thirds. Your navy is growing as well. Steam dry dock. Let's recruit. A batch of first, which are going to go out and act as... Um, well, they're going to be admirals. They're going to be a focus point for recruiting. So you're replenishing. Yeah, you're recovering. Well, you're getting extra troops. Yes. Okay. Añejo Bruno, you've been with us since the start. 
New men embark. Let's go get some American spoils for you. Signore. Signore. Giancarlo Vito. Let's get some goodies for you too. Good, that's where the next focus of our campaign is going to be. Let's just keep recruiting just sloops everywhere. Because we're going to have the garrison at Edinburgh is going to move out. Well, a lot, almost all of these are going to move out. Belfast, recruit, build a... Go to trade port... Okay, so you're still replenishing here. Paris, like I said, it's going to take some time to turn. Let's get these religious agents over here. Well, these um, rakes over here, rather. You're moving into position. Good, 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 good. Good, okay. Down here. Actually, you're, well, you're going to sit here, up here, ready to punt to jump onto Ardabil. You're going to come down here to the main road towards Persia. What is it you need? Two of something. Pronti agli ordini. Signor sì. Pronti. Io ready. Siamo pronti. Servo vostro, signore. You're going to go here and march through up to the north of Persia. I mean, that's really that's more than enough. More than enough to um, be getting on with. Mass recruit fourth rates out of Basra just in case they do sail to Troy. And then scepters. We've dealt with all of these. Let's put you. Flotta pronta. Pronti a virare. Ufficiale sul ponte. Something like that. Because you could be up to no good. You can't surprise us, but if you do come after us, we'll have to we will jump on your territories. I suppose in Venice we need to be let's build another army in Venice ready to go west sharpshooter and rifleman good but I mean yeah build one army to kind of sit here and fight an attack either fight an attack Savoyard or at least lay siege to them with one army, defeat this army in the field, then attack the city. That would make sense. Yes, you're not on strike. Okay, upgrade. Fair exchange, the roads are being upgraded. Okay, next, so next turn we should be ready to move out and build some more stuff. Great. Okay. They'll come back. I mean, if they scatter, we could be in trouble. But yeah, this is why we need fleets in a lot more places than we currently have them. Dagestan is presumably at some point going to start getting suspicious about why her and all of her allies are now being surrounded. Ooh. The Huron have attacked us, and they've teleported a bit. Uh, but yes, they, it looks like they are quite badly depleted. Their economy is shrinking. This is the thing with the with the Native American factions. Um, if because they their economic growth penalties are so strong, if they just stagnate, their economy just shrinks and shrinks and shrinks. <laughs> to the point at which they can't sustain their armies. So that, so they have to constantly be expanding. Because a city that produces a thousand gold will turn. Next turn will be producing nine hundred and seventy-four gold a turn, and I mean you'll get a tax. Well, no, well, if you get if you get taxed like ten percent, the overall like 
the overall number you might lose about 37 gold a turn but uh, what that actually costs you in your pocket is less than that because you get taxed a percentage of that amount rather than the full amount anyway let's get set up I'm going to let them come right at us let these devils do their worst bugs artillery piece who you love to see it bugs artillery pieces conscripts on one flank to extend it grenadiers on another carabiner I should put my carabiner on my conscript flank back them up with hussars heavy cavalry on the left general in the center Enforcements or the garrison. Get my house firing round shot. Just see if I can get any actual use out of them. And let's probably speed up time while the enemy are forming on the field. They are hidden. Oh god, all my howitzers went for this Native American lat. Oh god. Decided up. They, they were so keen. Okay, yeah, so the troops coming in and immediately hiding. Very well, off and on again. Just let them pick new targets. See if we can provoke the how the um, lancers to attack us. This is the benefit of the white man's artillery. It's really good. So there's the chief up front. Historically, towards our line. Because they want my, my good artillery, just keep engaging them. My heavy horse artillery, just keep shooting. First infantry units has been exposed. Go on, man. Make ready and fire. Oh, got hit. Alright, he doesn't like that. The general's gonna make it though, but he's not coming back. Here we go. Medicine man advancing up. ones are actually in good nick compared to the rest. Let's get my cuirassier out here. Those bowmen don't. You watch out, they, they could, I mean, advancing up these trees would be a good, good uh, route of attack. Tried in the back and hit these. Oh, where's my marine? Make sure my marines are on guard mode. On. through our lines. The grenadier 
players took some hits, but they're in good condition. Native American warrior have made it to our lines. They're going to be repulsed. Kill a bunch of my heavy cavalry. Start shrapnel shotting some of these units that are scamping around in front of us. Good, okay, right. Get you guys. Fire at will again. Get my crossier out of the way. Go oh, on, 30 seconds. There you go. Where's the... It's the general unit. Keep my... Ooh, actually. No, you're not, you're not in shrapnel range. Back you go. Kill some of the unit while it was stealth. Probably trying to shoot at these guys and it was misses that we're doing it. Where's my heavy cavalry? Just in case that might be it, actually. Could well be it because the enemy garrison is running away in tatters. There they are. Well, it's not them. There's the bow. Oh, the bow units are still to come in. Yeah, especially because I nicely managed to screw up the charge. Okay, get back. <laughs> Tomahawks. Well, they're not charging anymore. But they are doomed. Ever so slightly doomed. This was your idea. Native Americans. More units are still coming in. You're the aggressor. You have to try and you have to try and uh, win this action. Fire all off and on again. Just aim at that garrison native bow unit. There's another unit sneaking up. Two units, three units, four units. Well, as you guys are reloading. We are almost ready. The grenadiers on the flank here. Slaughtered. Absolutely slaughtered. Okay. Anyone else? You want some more? Yeah, it's the bowmen coming through now, so we might might still have a bit of fighting to go yet.
Fucking blast it. Blast these guys with shrapnel shots. So you guys try to get them with the shrapnel. No, they've already broken. Good hit though. You can see it blew. <laughs> it blew the line through those native troops. You're so mean. Scrap one shot of this unit of bowmen. Well, they're in the trees, so they might cause the shells to detonate early. Killed a couple on this, of this routing unit. And still getting kills. Yeah, it seems to very mean. Even me now when I switched to quick climb. Two shells detonate high. Good hits. Quick climb coming in, but they were misses. That wasn't. We're using chemical warfare. Uh, end the battle. We don't. We ideally we want those damaged units to garrison to re-garrison the city, but to be honest, it's probably not going to make much odds because the other garrison is very small anyway. Pirates are coming in to try and stop us from expanding in the Americas, but that's not going to help them. Their doom is decided. But let's go and just deal with these remaining troops. Destroy the their. Religious would we'll destroy their administration building and replace it with one of our own, with one of our own markets. Push down to the next city. Okay, build a church school. Great due to a global trading company. Pop down to these, down to this area because this is where we. You don't get notifications for dismantling buildings, but you do get them for buildings. Let's get those done. Construction report, Norway. Go through and upgrade all of Norway's things. Good. Dun dun dun. Upgrade the army stuff college near Morocco, just it's quite close to the frontier. Upgrade all of the Moroccan things, plus the roads. Not yet. Cagliari. Nardinia, the state capital. And the global trading company. Okay, top, 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 top. Build bow. Okay, Spain. Okay, two, two industrial units plus the farm. Yep, uh, roads as well in Madrid. Excellent. Ireland. Poland needs a top tier farm. Portugal, it's got a lot of things it can upgrade. Alright, keep the Catholic conversion going. Newfoundland has a new port, we've got lots of new, uh, new fleets. Oh, one second, guys. Sorry about that. Uh, right. Is Quebec one of their annoying protectorates? It is. Very well. So one of you is going to land and take Florida. See if that brings us into war against, against uh, the Americans. No fleets to hide, no ports I can hide in, rather, but we can hide in. Ooh. You can run in. Wait, 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 wait. wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Oh no, it's because I got you from I got you from the uh, city. Yeah, you can't make it. You haven't got the movement points. Fair enough. Uh, okay.
Okay, let's just nick. There we go, get into San Juan. Deposit the militia to protect the port. Then bring the sloop back to Leo. Actually, I don't need to do that. Wait, I do, no, I do want to protect, protect the port. Okay, it's San Juan, build some sloops, because it looks like the, it, the pirates are going to stop us from getting one out of here. Although we could use... Could just use you. I know you're waiting for um, your pirate buccaneer unit. You hold fast. No, we're not gonna we're not gonna fight a we're not gonna fight an assault against um, enemy fortified walls. That's just gonna take too long. Right, get you guys reinforced. Good. Get the government building repaired. Are the roads good? Yes, they are. All the all the um. Industry is max level, which is good. Is New Spain anyone's ally? No, they are not. Hey, although we could just start sweeping. No, let's go take. Go to, well, go have a look at what's on the coast near Caracas. Not very much. Okay, let's land to the west. Declare war. Don't call our allies in. You men scamper into that port. Just block the pirates. Although, actually, no, our agents are still on board. Naturally, <laughs> I deposited my agents in that territory. Okay, actually, I might drop them into Martinique because it's even harder for the pirates to stop you. My rake's going to go forward to Bogota, see what's going on. Then we've still got one up here, who, the Inuit of one of the Dagestan Confederates. My, do I land you to go and attack? Uh, I might land you to attack Panama. Just to cut the new Spanish Empire in half, prevent them from reinforcing from the north. Well, it takes a bit of time for the ship to get here. There it is. Yeah, let's attack Panama. Let's bring the city into our control. Then we can mop up South America, push up, take Mexico City, then on into Texas, and then hit Louisiana from the west. Nice. Very nice indeed. How it says, form up. Bombard the city with quicklime. My actual artillery. Go up here. So one brigade to go around one flank and my elite brigade go around the left you men just very 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 badly optimised my objective isn't to fight in the town it's to see if we can push around it and flank the enemy It looks like we might be able to see them advancing towards us, which is great. You men up on the hill. Really, I want my Swiss Mountain Jaeger in the town hall. Cavalry. Here on the 
flank. We have a light cav push forward up into the trees. Actually, we might have to make more of a stand in the town. Time some of these other yeah, the units get established. Don't hear an enemy charge. Yeah, that's okay. No, oh, Jaeger, get into the house. Why you just stood there? They just they've just stopped. Okay, no, they're gonna die. They got them to charge. Form square. Another infantry unit in. The cavalry's all are whipping around the flanks. How it serves attack some of these blocks of men. My gunners can't really engage anything. Yeah, you guys, I don't know why they've just stopped. around the flank. Clear down the enemy mortars. Warm up and just put some fire onto those musketeers because my mountain Jaegers are doing a good job at standing here and dying. I'm going to leave, leave them where they are to see what happens. It's a bit of an experiment. Okay, let's try to kill some of these colonial militia. Just to make sure they do wrap. Yeah, he finally routed. Let's see if I can get my artillery to actually... Out of range of round shot, out of range of a uh, canister shot, track or shot rather. Okay, you guys. Something like. You guys sparrow into the militia. Okay, you guys finally get into that house. They want you to. Come on, line up your guards are gonna charge the militia. To be, <laughs> to be honest, a lot of the enemy is no longer with us. Bomb squared. You can charge into us or just keep shooting. So if you click the corner of us. Expect this. Break the charge towards the enemy in square shape. There we 
go. Heavy infantry will make short work of you, fellows. Push through. Save the 107th. Excellent. I missed this unit of militias, the last unit on the field. God, fighting in cities like that is always a real... Unless you're super methodical about pushing up and clearing it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Just clipped the corner of my own infantry unit there. Didn't get many... Oh, look! I don't know how. Oh, I only lost two fellows in that. Excellent. I think you got one over on us. You are wrong. Towers over there. Here comes the regiment of horse barreling in. Seems fine. Slaughter them. Excellent. Good, good, good. Well, that's Panama captured. That's the new Spanish Empire chopped in two. Fortify it, just in case we have to try and defend it. Get replenishing. Uh, not a huge amount to, to worry about upgrading. Panama will probably be booming soon. Yes, five... <laughs> So the regular pop growth is 0.5%. Is People emigrating from Europe has gone up to 5.5%. So eight turns. Puerto Bello is going to grow, which is the port. And then we've got another town, which will become... Probably become a Catholic school, just to make sure we work through this area. And then push up towards Texas. Nice. Well, that's very good. Okay, I think that's... All of the armies committed... Everybody else is just getting into position. Good, good. This force that's going to attack Bavaria is in good condition. Could probably do with a second. Just appear towards Prague. Rodolfo Avogadro. Let's get a regiment of horse. Light cav sharpshooters and heavy cav. I do have a standard pattern for armies. And it does seem a reasonable... For my place style, it seems like a reasonable balance. Let's get my skirmishers in first. A unit of sharpshooters and a unit of... Rifleman. There we go. Done. Uh, elsewhere, I, I do think it's probably enough across the board. Let's upgrade a couple of these buildings to the last level. We've got we've got enough money. We can afford to upgrade these things. Two priests in Ukraine. Don't need two of you. Let's move you over to Flanders, I suppose. Nobody's trying to convert Flanders right now. And they'll convert along the way. It's part of their great pilgrimage. Good, 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 good. All oh, this has been done. Yep. Uh, nowhere for you to hide. Well, you can hide in. Oh, no. The pirates, the pirates are here. 
Okay, that fleet's going to definitely... That sloop's going to definitely die. Cool. Let's hit end turn. The fleets continue to grow. Good. That's exactly what we wanted to happen. We wanted their troops to move in to garrison their city. Another port in the middle of the Mediterranean needs to be upgraded. Uh, auto resolve. La flotta è perduta. <laughs> Last. Yes, pirates. Ah, oh, bad pirates. Protect my trade, my trade possessions. You can do that if you like. It's just going to cost you in the long run, pirates. You're only delaying the inevitable. Port blockaded, port blockaded, fleet destroyed. Okay, upgrade that. Cambridge and Oxford have both become good. Catholic centres of excellence. Upgrade the in workshops in Crimea. Yeah, just keep to be honest, we're at a point right now. We just keep upgrading everywhere. You can't go any higher. Keep upgrading everything, because you never know where the enemy might surprise us when we have to scratch up an army from somewhere. There you go. Belfast has a commercial port. The Agane. The trade port. Good, good, good. Now our economy is going to be booming. Another Jesuit college in France. Just keep converting them back to Catholicism as quickly as possible. In Rhodes as well. Good. Okay, so let's build some more sloops out of this port. Then we'll be able to sail on and attack somewhere else. Let's take this sloop out. Get the army from Santo Domingo. Attack Antigua. The pirate, the pirate capital. That's not a decent fight. Oh, that actually. Let's make sure to no, we don't forget to do this and this although to be honest that's probably going to be an auto resolve uh, don't repair the military governor's barracks burn it down we're not going to be short of military production okay, you're 100% catholic we could probably stand to you're going to get Pensacola's going to grow plus there is another there yes okay same with the Bahamas, that's just a chomp. Although we did lose a unit there. Get the army replenished. Although, to be honest, what we really want out here when we, when we lose units is we replace them with buccaneers. Okay, you're ready to go. You're ready to go. Right, it's time, it's time to tee up for the next episode. So... Thanks for watching guys, hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you next time for the capture of Antigua, the pirate capital. The pirate capital will move, but they're certainly on there, on the back foot right now. Rightio, cheers everyone.